hardcore division, I can tell you, but he is not the champion. Shane McMahon is the champion. Oh, a knee! Oh, the knee catch. That's on, no fair! Right on both knees, Blackman cracking Shane and then on the back of the head. I think it really shorten your career getting your knees hit like that. Blackman has almost got this thing in cruise control now that he has this used all those weapons on Shane's knees as back. His head. Oh, my God, the back of his head. Here, Blackman, he said, this is my house. I believe it. I don't want to come in. I don't want to visit. We'll just keep on driving by that yeah. neighborhood. I'll honk when I come by. Oh, no. Blackman throwing more cans in. He must have a lot of trash at his house. Sticks! Uh-oh. Oh, it doesn't, oh, no. doesn't look good for Shane McMahon right now, I'll tell you. See, you remember a leather strap like that? Yeah. A razor strap? Yeah, I went to Woodshed. You were a kid. Woodshed a time or two. Oh, wait, hey, wait a minute now. Well, maybe Shane wants to see what's coming. That's the only salvation I can oh, give him. Yeah. This is a new, new meaning to taking out the trash. Can you imagine what this is going to feel? Oh, 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 oh. And compacted like Max Weinberg in the Max Weinberg seven. Get out of there, Shane, if you can. Oh, great kick by Steve Blackman on Shane McMahon, who's we're not somewhere. done yet. Oh, we're not good. I think Shane didn't want to hear that. Glad to hear that. I almost think that Shane McMahon might be of a mindset, just might be maybe, to say, Go ahead and take the title and leave me alone. Can you tap out in one of these matches? I don't think you can. That doesn't look good for the uh, next generation of McMahons on that move. <laughs> And now Blackman with that leather strap. I can assure you that Shane McMahon is not too familiar with a leather strap growing up in Greenwich. I don't think they allow leather straps in the city limits of no. Greenwich. No, they're banished. They just send their misguided uh, kids to a psychologist. Riddling, maybe. <laughs> oh, Shane by the neck. Blackman. Well, Blackman is almost as if he's punishing Shane for the treatment Blackman got last week. Oh, oh, oh. And Shane oh. being jerked right off the, the, the pump buckles right by his neck. All right, Blackman, that's enough. You had your fun. You gonna do hog time? Maybe. Oh, so Shane McMahon. Wait, look at this. Shane McMahon, Shane McMahon being stretched out there by Blackman. Hey, wait a minute. Oh, Tessin Albert. Tag Team Champ. No, Tessin Albert, you're right. I thought it was Eddie Christian. Tessin Albert. 
assaulting Blackman. And remember, there's no thing that referee Jim Corderas can do. These hardcore rules. No disqualification. No stopping the match. Nothing. They let it hit pretty much anything go. Yes. Yeah, you're bleeding yes. all over the place. Yes. Oh. What happened there? <laughs> Blackman has been taken down by Albert. And now we got essentially three men against one. Shane McMahon testing Albert. Yes. This is sort of how, how this is sort of how Blackman lost this title to begin with, isn't it? And what but what irony that Shane McMahon's on the same page with Test when Test was left at the altar a year or so ago, almost ready to marry Shane's sister. Yeah, but don't you remember what, what Test said a couple of weeks ago when he saw Stephanie? Like he counted his blessings, didn't he? Yeah. And Albert 350, six feet eight. And Blackman now just being decimated. It quite frankly it seems to be just a matter of time it would think you would think before Blackman will succumb to these these three men. Shane McMahon about to get back up. He is back up now. Oh, what's this? Now, this is true trash compacting. Oh, no! Oh. Test right off the top rope. That huge elbow. It's getting right down to the heart of the matter there. Driving the trash can right into the heart of uh, Steve Blackman and now Test and Albert. Uh oh look at Shane. He's warming up. He's getting that footwork going. Well, Shane's a brave son of a gun right now. Here come these stinging lefts. Oh, wow. Now the giant killer. Floating like a butterfly and stinging like a bee. He's a tough son of a gun with testing out and holding Blackman, isn't he? Oh, wait a minute. He wants a little more. Uh... Oh, no! Right back to Shane's face. But Blackman knocked down by Albert. And here comes Test and Albert with a shoe leather. Blackman does that kind of stuff like you see in movies. I mean, you just don't think it's possible, but he really does. Yes. Shane McMahon with a sign. Oh, a metal sign that just cracked over Blackman. Maybe right over his face. I'm not sure. That got him right there. Blackman oh, holding yes. it as all his parts are still on his face. <laughs> like his nose, his eyes, his lips. I think he thought his forehead was going to be in the end. Uh, uh, Shane. Wow. Oh, man, that was a shot. Sounded like a rifle going off. And now Shane McMahon has got Blackman by the, around the neck of that leather strap. He's dragging Blackman someplace. We're going to go. Get on! Shane McMahon telling TNA to get on Blackman. It's three on one here. Let's get well, this means anything goes and falls down anywhere. But you know what this kind of shows you? It's a graphic illustration of one thing. What's that? Blackman has no friends. I mean, if anybody was his friend, they could come in here and help me all Man! I don't know how much that, bit, that speaker, that, that equipment weighs. That hey, thousand pounds. It hit with a thud on the concrete floor. That's what Blackman is now. All four, so to speak. See if Blackman had one friend in the back. They could come out and help Blackman. There'd be no repercussions. Maybe they're too intimidated to come out and help me, knowing that he doesn't want any help. I don't know. I think he's got no friends. That's enough, guys. No! no. Albert just got passed with a kendo stick. And now Blackman's got the stick away from Albert. There goes Albert. They passed by Shane in the back of the head and Shane McMahon coming out of nowhere with a clothesline. In a way, that's the best thing to do. And Shane now is going to try to distance himself from Blackman. Who oh, he's right behind you. Where are you going? Where the hell is Shane going? He's gonna get out of harm's way. He's gonna get out of the reach of Blackman. Whoa, watch it. Good, good move. Shane McMahon climbing upstairs. Oh, wait a minute. Shane, you're treed. I got the You're right, King. He's treed. He can't walk. It's like Shane McMahon was a coon and Blackman is a coon dog. Wait a minute, Shane. That's about as far as you can go. Blackman, come on, let him down. Oh, God, how high are they? Shane McMahon could only go a couple more feet. Shane, what are you doing? They must be. 50 or 75 feet in the air. Look, I think Blackman's getting a nosebleed. Ow! Right in the knee. And Shane McMahon lost the, the use of one of those legs. Blackman coming up there to get Shane. Blackman's got that kindle stick with him. What are you doing, Shane? My God, this is dangerous. Shane McMahon, this is... Okay, when he goes up that side, you go down the other. We've got this. Oh, come on, Blackman. I scream here. All right, he probably gets up. Yeah, get him down. Shane McMahon brought this on his own.
but he was knocked off that that staging. What did they land on? And Clyde went up bleeding and bruised. But oh my God, Shane McMahon has got to be just. There's no way, King, that he could have. I don't know how he's even breathing. Oh, no, I don't want to. The EMTs, they got the EMTs there. Well, I don't know if I will believe this when I see it again. I don't think anybody, you may not even want to watch this. This has got to be 70 feet in the air! Shane McMahon, his body just ripped from that.